Hello, and welcome back to the Let's Play of Might and Magic Book 2, Gates to Another World. So, as you can see, we're in front of Middlegate Inn. I have leveled up, again, Sir Hydran and Drog. Uh, sorry about the disappointing last episode. It was kind of uh, short because I didn't know what to do, and it felt like we were fighting a lot of different monsters that were way above our level. So, I have kind of trained and, you know, done a little bit of uh, farming for some different items and just increased some armor. Uh, but now I think we're going to try something new. So, on the map here, uh, there is a portal person over here. Remember, we found someone who would offer a travel to a different place. I think we're going to try that. Normally, I wouldn't do that, but it almost seems like the game kind of wants us to go there. Um, all right, so... Yes, we're going to Sanzibar. All right, so boom, we are in a whole other town, and there is quite a lot on this map here. Uh, we are right here, and so, hey, it looks like we can be transported back to Middlegate for another 20 gold. All right, with that being said, let's see, there's the Portal Dune. Let's see what's over here. The slums. Ah, okay. I want to find the inn first, and we can just save. So, looks like uh, there's a Fit Pro Locksmith. While deftly sleeping the curves, uh, while deftly shaping the curves of a slender yellow key, the shopkeeper announces, "Finished at last. Buy this little beauty for a thousand gold." Eh, sure, man. Why not? You know, we have the the yellow key. We have the green key as well. All right. So walking around town doesn't look too different. The sandy dunes. Lucky Spade, the best gambler alive, will teach you his system for two hundred gold take the special course uh let me check the answer to this is going to be no i've planned out the skills ahead of time for us so we're not going to be getting uh this skill which will just increase luck we're actually going to be getting another skill later on in this same town actually so let's say no and then we're going to head out and let's go north let's see the embassy Ronaldo, the ultimate ambassador, will instruct you in the gentle art of diplomacy for 500 gold. Hmm, well, I think that is a yes, but let me see what I have, because that's going to be me. Awesome, perfect. These are the two skills I want for me, the cleric, because uh, that should boost up some spell power and whatever. I'm not entirely sure how the personality stat works, but these are the two skills that I want for myself. All right, Sly's Opportunities. Sly, a seedy looking rogue, will teach you how to pickpocket for 300 gold. Yes, and we're going to give that to Ferris. Now, off screen, I went back to that brain surgery place and removed Ferris's skill and relearned Pathfinder and pickpocket. So we've got these two skills that we want. That's good. And uh, now let's continue exploring. So I'm glad we did this because this is definitely the way to go instead of just wandering out in the wilderness like I was. This is a training arena. All right. Looks like they, we can train. Do I need any training? Uh, nope. None. All right. Okay. And the end. Cool. Yes, we do want to do that. I, I wish it wasn't so kind of like my, uh, my OCD organizational tendencies are definitely wanting me to like sort that, but I don't exactly know how. <laughs> Anyways. All right. That's fine. Let's go over to this here. Uh, what's in here? Drunk beyond belief, a sorcerer mumbles. Join the magic guild. Burp. I can't do a sound effect for a burp, but yes, of course. Yep, we joined the mages guild there. All right, and let's see what's in here. A uh, Sirico portal. All right, a dusty nomad offers transport to Tandara for fifty gold. Except yes, no. So no for now, because we're still exploring around. All right, what's in here? Temple Benedictus. Hello. Ambergris or ambergris and wood cedar. Oh, I've never seen that word before. I guess that's kind of like a scent. Ambergris, ambergris and wood cedar incense burns on the altar as the priest chants. He asks, "Do you need any help?" Yes. So let's uh let's see if we can't learn some spells while we're here. All right, learning two two and learning two five and learning two seven. Cool. Some. Oh yeah, I don't think we actually need to. Uh, from what I can tell, hirelings will know all the spells right out of the box. The Red Lantern Tavern. All right. Hello. Um, amidst bloodthirsty brawling stands luscious Lucindra, or Lucindra, 
the barmaid. Bottles fly through the air as she asks, Can I do you something? Yes. All right, let's see. Uh, That's kind of high price for food. I think double than middle gates. Uh, let's see. Specialties. What you got? All right, some dinner and whatnot. Cool. Yeah, sure. You can have that. And then I'll feed Al the same thing. We're all going to be eating roast peasant tonight. That's what I would like. Oh, what did it say? Did it say spoiled or something like that? <laughs> let's see. What's... Oh, I can't feed the recruits or the hirelings, unfortunately. Cool. That's awesome. All right. Let's tip the bartender and let's listen for rumors. The gourmet. A3. Okay. All right. There is something here. The bar fight. Let's go save before we try to do the bar fight, I think. Although I, did, I don't know if it's a bar fight, but I assume that that is why there is an there. So. All right. Let's do it. As chairs and tables fly, a mug hits you in the face. Brawl, yes or no? Yes. Bring it on. 40 plus tr thug trainees. Oh my gosh. The juggler juggles the party. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Let's see if we can... Oh, well, we've reversed... Uh, did something happen with the order? Yeah, it did. That's That's kind of funny. All right, Greg, take out that juggler. Sylvana, shoot the inept wizard. And me, I'm going to cast... Uh, well, I was going to cast Bless, but I think it might be more important for me to cast the Acid Spray on the Inept Wizard at the moment. So let's take them down. Cool. And Willard Mal, go ahead and ch uh, change out with Sylvanas there. All right, Ferris, go ahead and shoot the Super Spray. Oh, the Juggler, actually. I think the Juggler is kind of important there. I'm going to cast a uh, Shield. All right. And okay. Draw, go ahead and attack the juggler. Oh, you missed. All right, the mugger. Kind of a problem as well. But I wanted to get rid of that juggler so he could stop moving us around. All right, Grug, go ahead and attack the super sprite, I think. Man, it's tough to figure out which is the actual priority here. Acid spray. Awesome, bring him down. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the mugger. And go ahead and shoot the uh, super sprite. Cast. I'm going to cast invisibility. And I think the Super Sprites can actually do some damage to us, but there's only a few, so no problem. Uh, we're going to shoot him. Rug attack. Cool. Mal attack. All right, and now I'm going to control A through the fight and see if we can't get through this without just dying here. I, hopefully I'm not actually killing them, because it is just a bar fight, but, you know. Look at the... <laughs> I guess the Sprite... Oh, it looks like he has a, a flame or something. I don't know what the Sprite is doing. That's kind of funny. All right. And we're done. 2,400 experience. Lucindra hints. New tips on odd and even every 30th and 180th day. Cool. Well, thanks, Lucindra. All right. Lucindra, I think. All right. Let's go save before we die. Oh, I might have forgotten to search. Dang it. But that's okay. No problem. Well, it was fun. Looks like there's a store here. Big Al's accessories. A tough old blacksmith glares at your party and shouts, Hey! Only cowards browse view wares, yes or no. A. All right, got a Wakazashi there. Let's see what specials they've got. Some cool stuff. I don't think that's going to really replace anything that we have. Uh, same for this. I don't think that really replaces what we found. A force potion? Hmm. That's uh, There's a yellow ticket. Hey, I might want that because the green ticket allowed us to fight in the arena, so that'll do the same thing there. I don't think we need any of those other items. And let's see. I think that's it for the store. Cool. I might come back and just look and make sure that we're not missing anything. Um, let's see. What's over here? Whirlwind Mage Guild. Okay. The sorcerers sort files of sands on their shelves. A man barks. Spells. Yes. All right. So let's go ahead and get some stuff here for Kurgan. Buying some stuff. Cool. Hopefully we can actually have some AOE spells this time. That'd be nice. All right. Uh, I don't think... Let me go ahead and just save again before we continue on. Would rather not run into something that just wipes us out instantly. There seems to be something over here. The wizard's eye. Right? Oh. The beggar's gift. A one-eyed beggar will teach your party the wizard eye spell for 100 gold. Absolutely, yes. All right. Okay. And, all right, there's the monster bowl. So over there is the arena. And then up here in the northeast corner of the map, it seems like there's a bunch of encounters here. Uh, I'm just going to try and run from that. All right. 
back over in the run square. And it looks like, just on the map from what I see, there's quite a lot of stuff on the eastern side of the map. And on the western side is kind of like the, the skill training, the temples, the stores, and stuff like that. So uh, let me save, and then we're going to try and go after the yellow one first. No idea what it's going to be. I did not read it. I know it does pop it up on the bottom there, but I'd rather not do that. Let me rest, and then I'm going to just cast our spell stack. But I do probably want to relook at what sort of spells we have now. So, did we gain anything like good? Ah, so 2 5, protection from elements. I'm going to cast that. And then, oh, 3 2. Uh, no. All right, so what about 6? What about Kurrigan? What can he cast now? He can also cast protection from magic. Okay. And he can also cast now Eagle Eye. All right, cool. So we've gained some stuff there. That's great. So let's save before we go over there. I think we've rested up. Everybody's, oh, diseased. Oh, dang it. Okay, who's diseased again? That's Ferris. Okay, I want to cast Cure Disease. And I thought, oh, yeah, I do have it. Okay, cool. All right. Is she all right? Let's see, Ferris. Okay, I think we're good. I'm just going to save again. Sorry about that. And let's go over to the uh, arena. Or no, sorry, not the arena. The top right, which has like a yellow square. There's something in here. Right, the hidden wall. Locked. You four. You surprised the monsters. All right. Attack. Well, they're not really much. They're monsters. They're just hunchbacks. All right, bring him down cast i'm gonna go ahead and cast uh did i get any cool spells i can use uh nothing so i'm just gonna cast acid spray acid spray again all right ferris go ahead and shoot c Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot b oh not affected okay what about do we have anything cool yet so hey i've got um i learned acid stream that's to one party or one target i learned lightning bolt and I learned Cold Beam. Okay, let's try that. See what happens. Ah, oh, cool. So that's that's going to be the cool AoE spell, I think. And let's just control A through that. Awesome. Just uh, 22 gold. So not really awesome, but hey, <laughs> at least it's something, right? Oh, hey. Uh, I don't think we want to fight those guys. All right. Let me save, and then we'll go to the arena. And here we are in the Monster Bowl. Let's do it. All right, the game's master accepts your ticket. Let the battle begin. Let's go. All right, Grug, attack the gargoyle. Mal, attack the gargoyle. Bring him down. I'm going to cast, uh, I think, four or one, is it? Oh, wait a minute. I don't have enough. Oh, no. I've run out of gems. It's finally happened. All right, well, that's kind of scary for us, honestly. Ferris, go ahead and uh, actually exchange you with Trog. And Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot that gargoyle. Kurkin, let's see what you got. Uh, it looks like the spell thing is broken again, fortunately. That's all right. Maybe I can fix it on the fly. Let me see anything. No? Okay. What was it? 3-1? Yeah, there we go. I think 3-1 was the lightning bolt. So it looks like we took a little bit of damage there. It's okay. And Grug attack. I'll attack. I'm going to have to attack Sylvanas shoot. Kurgan again. I think it's 3-1. Well, I guess that's a single target spell. I don't I don't know what's going on. Oh, let me look at the look at the spells again. All right. Hopefully it comes up now. Shoot the gargoyle. Drag attack. Iron attack. Oh, attack again. Cool. And attack. Shoot him. Kurgan, what do you have? Okay. Going to look over at my sorcerer spell. Oh, it's sorry. Acid stream is three one. It's three four, which I don't have enough points for. <laughs> All right, how many? Oh, uh, how many spell points do I have? I've got one. Uh, is there anything I can cast that costs one? Yes, flame arrow. All right, gets flamed. And of course, you don't miss or resist or whatever. So, <laughs> and we can just control A through that. I think. 
All right, or not. There we go. And I didn't get anything for it. That's okay. Sorry, but you must have a ticket to compete in these games. So cool. We've done that. Awesome. We can go back over to the end and save. And I'm going to step out and I'm going to rest, of course, and then cast back up our spells. Of course, I do need to work in that to our stack. All right, I added the spells to the auto hotkey script, and you can see our spell stack has increased. We've got some resistances. So we've completed the arena, but there are some other encounters on the map here, up in like the north, east, west, and southeast and west, but I don't think we're going to do those. So uh, let's continue on to the bottom right of the map and see what's going on there. This is the slums, okay? Sewage and muck ooze underfoot. A horde of giant rats gnaw on a still struggling victim. Yes, absolutely we need to help him. All right, let's attack. Gnome elders. Oh god. The vampiric rat is kind of scary, I would say. And let's go ahead and cast uh, acid spray. Bring them down. Ferris, go ahead and shoot the vampiric rat. I think those might be a problem. And I'm going to cast Lightning Bolt on all of them. Okay, bring them down. Uh, Dro, go ahead and exchange with Ferris. I have a feeling we're going to be doing a lot. All right, Grug, attack Vampiric Rat. There we go, brought them down. Now we can focus on the gnome. Okay, cast again. And I did get more gems, by the way. I just shared some from everybody else. And bring down the gnome elders. Kurgan, go ahead and cast your... It's a 3-4 Lightning Bolt. Our body's hurting too badly here. Okay. Man, all right. Oh, he's not in combat anyway, so I kind of exchanged for nothing, unfortunately. That's all right. Drug attack. I'll attack uh, 4-1-E. Acid spray all of them. And Sylvana shoot them. All right. And Lightning Bolt. Here we go. Bring them down. Now, this isn't that bad of a battle. Hopefully we can... Just hurt, or, well, we can control A through it. All right. Did we, hey, ray gun plus two. Okay, that's that's actually worth going back to the end and saving for, because I can, I'll explain what that actually does. All right, so as far as I know, right now I have it equipped to Warlord Mal, who has the regular ray gun, and that increases accuracy. Accuracy plus five. And if I use the item, it would do an energy blast. So I think he's got accuracy. It looks like the ray gun plus two, of course, would be accuracy plus seven. Um, I want to do, hmm, I almost think it's worth giving it to, still to Warlord Mal, just because he has the two-handed weapon, and when he hits, he's going to hit like a truck as long as he can hit. So I think that that's the strategy I'm going for, and I'm going to give him, hey, you can equip that as well, so that's pretty cool. All right, and... Save up here, and let's go back down to the slums. Unfortunately, we didn't seem to help anyone there, but I guess that's okay. Ah, let me... Kilroy was here, the cripples are... Yeah, beware of eyes, the Meisters. All right, let me uh, write this down. Okay, so I wrote that down, but I honestly, when I was typing it down, I honestly don't think it's anything important, because... This seems to be graffiti. <laughs> it kind of took me by surprise, and then I like I read "Hi, Mom," and I was like, "Okay, so this is not really a just scrambled thing that you have to do." But maybe I'm wrong, right? Like "Spork and Orc," XOXO. I mean, it's it's just kind of something obvious, but kind of humorous could trip you up. There's also a secret wall behind it. <laughs> All right, an old wino belches. belches. The snow beast has a secret lair in the city walls. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go down here. Uh, Sallow-eyed beggars and cripples crowd the alley, pleading for a handout. Toss them a gold piece? Uh, sure, why not? Day 93 is nature's day. Yeah, there's some stuff on the maps that I've noticed that have oh, glowing eyes follow your progress. But what I was saying is that some things on the map I've noticed aren't activated because there aren't the certain day. So I'm sure Nature's Day has something to do with that. All right. Let's see what's back here. Muggers. Okay. All right. Well, sorry, but I don't really like muggers that much. So 
go go down as best I can. I've got let's see. Let's cast bless, yeah. Do that. Back. Sylvana shoot him. Bergen, go ahead and cast your uh lightning bolt. Oh. Well I guess it failed. Okay. Oh oh no, it didn't fail. It just went out of it for one reason. That was odd. Not sure what happened there. Okay. Dryron attack. Attack and done. Cool. Well, that was interesting. I thought there'd be something about the eyes here. And also along the slums, there are hidden walls. And uh, on the Easter side, I could go through it here, but I don't know why the glowing eyes follow my progress. Well, where is it? All right. Oh, hey, actually, I didn't see it on the mini map, but there is a hidden wall here. And going in here, there is another encounter. So maybe this is the glowing eyes. Oh, my goodness. Check out that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's attack. Fight. I have no idea. I doubt that we can survive, unfortunately. I'm going to turn undead. Hey, dancing bones are eradicated. All right, so I'm going to exchange with Drog because he needs to be in combat. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the minor demon. We've brought him down. Kurgan, go ahead and cast your lightning bolt. Not enough points. Oh, no. You got one point left. Okay. All right, so let's see. Hmm. You got sleep. Let's try. I didn't think you'd be affected, but it was worth a good shot, I guess. Energy blast. Oh, no. Okay, so 37 points of damage there. That was quite a lot. Drug attack, mal attack. I've got to cast 2 1 and heal. Well, is there actually there anything better that I can heal? Uh, cure wounds looks like to be the best right now. Bonus, go ahead and shoot. Bergen, shoot the minor demon. And we're going to shoot too. Nice. Bring him down. Oh, no. Some damage on us. That's okay. I can revive him up. Drug attack. I'm going to cast again on Warlord Mal. Shoot the minor demon. Shoot him. Nice. Good job, Drog. 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 Kind of mix it up a little bit. It's always troubling with O. You never know how it needs to be pronounced, you know? All right, I'm going to cast Heal on Warlord Mal again. Shoot the Dancing Bones. You know what I should do is cast Turn Undead again. Uh, actually, maybe we don't need to. Just need to... Oh, it's not affected. Okay. Well, dang. All right. So what... Uh, hmm. Looks like they're not really affected by lots of... Oh, they need to be like plus one items, I assume. Something like that. That's odd. Huh. All right. What's really going to happen here? <laughs> All right. Here we go. Frog attack. Attack. Dang. None of my heavy hitters can really attack that well. Uh, what can I do? Can I do anything? Hmm. Well, I can heal Sylvanas for sure, because that seems to be the best way that we're getting around this uh, fight. Right? Okay. That is a bummer. That none of my spells seem to work. Or not spells, but none of my plus one weapons seem to really work against that. Okay. Let's see if we can bring them down. All right, there's one. I definitely need to heal. Right? Shoot. Ah. Maybe I need to use something from Grug. I don't I don't really know. Alright. Heal up him. Shoot them down. Cool. Alright, bring them down. Nice. And we took them out. Awesome. Beat that encounter. There's some demons in the slums. Took them down, and we're gonna go save. And uh oh, okay, we're we're gonna run from that. So I don't want to accidentally kill the party right as soon as we finished all that. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, till next time, see you then. Bye-bye.